In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make a portfolio website using Google Sites. So the first thing you want to do is to go inside Google Sites. I just googled Google Sites and I get the Google Sites here. And when you uh, are inside Google Sites, you, uh, if you haven't logged in, you probably need to log in, but uh, I am logged in, so uh, that's okay for now. So in order to make a uh, portfolio website um, you can uh, go about this in a few uh, different ways um, uh, you can make it from uh, scratch using a blank site uh, or you can use uh, one of the templates uh, as you can see here uh, at the template gallery we have a photo portfolio here we have a portfolio template here and we also have a student portfolio um, under education I, I really like this um, photo portfolio here so i want to make uh, one from this one and as you can see here we have uh, a pre-made template uh, of uh, the photo uh, portfolio so what you want to do next is to actually start uh, editing it so the first thing you can do is actually to uh, publish it and then you can uh, give it a name um, you can give it your name or uh, whatever you want and then you want to click publish yeah so uh, the first thing uh, you can do is to actually um, rename uh, the header so what you can do then is to uh, just click the text and then you uh, give it a new name Uh, you can also um, add your logo if you have one uh, or you can and you can add a favicon uh, if you have one uh, if you have a logo you just click upload and then you find, find um, and put in uh, the logo I'm just going to leave it uh, like this for now uh, I think that text is uh, kind of cool and the next thing you want to do is to have a look at um, these um, these uh, photos here which are linking to project sites and as you can see here it's portraits it's studio it's sports and what you want to do now is to actually um, you know your topics uh, on your own portfolio site so let's say you have uh, one uh, with like sports so just uh, name it sports and you just click it and then the three dots and then replace image and you can either upload or you can select I will just click select and here if you have uh, photos on Google Drive you can find it there if you have a link you can um, uh, provide your link you can uh, use Google images so I will just use Google images and I'll, then I will search for sports so let's just use this one and then you click insert and as you can see here it's we now have the sports and then you want to make a project page for uh, your sports sports photos and you can do that by going to pages and then uh, we are inside work that's the uh, main page and you want to create a sports uh, project page uh, this is the um, page that is uh, the project page that is uh, in the templates so this you can just delete if you want and then you want to click the three dots and you want to add a sub page and let's name it sports and then done uh, and as you can see here uh, you can now edit uh, 
the, the sports uh, sub page. But what I want to do next is to go to the work page again. And then I want to link this text here to the sports sports sub page. You just insert link. And as you can see here, we now have the sports sub page uh, as an option here. You just click it and then you click apply. And now uh, you can do um, the same with uh, every of these sites. Uh, if you want to, if you don't have uh, as many um, projects or pages as this template, you can just click it and then you can just um, click delete group. If you have more, you can actually just click it, uh, click duplicate. And as you can see here, it's now the same. And then you can just move it uh, like up here. You have to, you can duplicate uh, this text box as well. Um, duplicate, and then you can uh, just move it uh, under here. And then you can uh, rename it again. And you also want to uh, add the link and you want to uh, add a new photo. So to, um, if you want to uh, like edit the sub pages, you just go to pages uh, at the right here and then you click sports. And here you uh, click insert and you want to um, uh, insert uh, your portfolio to uh, this page right here uh, you can either to if you have uh, them on your computer you can click upload uh, for this video I'm just going to click select let's use uh, this one let's click insert and uh, you can uh, actually edit this you can move it around you can um, make it bigger and you can adjust it uh, just like you want and then you can add uh, for instance like a text box and you can change the color of the text you can change uh, the size, you can make it bold, you can change uh, the font, and so on and so forth. So you, you really just have to play around with it. You can also put like um, uh, content blocks. Uh, you can see at the right here, uh, we have templates for uh, different uh, photo blocks. You can use this one. Uh, or and then you just click the plus symbol and you just choose upload picture upload photo sorry and or select image so let's just put in this one and then click insert and then you can uh, edit the text here. I don't even know if, if there is uh, skiing in Rocky Mountains. I just assume it. So this is... Um, how you can edit uh, the sub page and down here you have uh, like the footer you can edit the footer you can put in your email address and you can put in your phone number and you can put in um, your social media if you have a facebook page youtube channel and so on and so forth maybe an instagram account so so this is uh how to edit your footer 
and the last thing I want to show you is how you can uh, edit the about page you just click the about page here uh, if you uh, when you have a portfolio website um, it's it's really nice to have uh, your own uh, about page so you can just uh, edit the text here you can put in your self portrait uh, or another por or another image and you can put in your email address and uh, like uh, phone number if you have any clients that want to um, that want to give you a testimonial you can do that here you can uh, put in your work experience and education if you don't want this you can just uh, click it and then you can uh, click uh, the trash can and remove it and so so this is actually a really easy uh, method to make a photo portfolio page in Google Sites and when you are done editing the site you just click publish up in the top right corner and as you can see here um, you have the draft here and you can compare it to the old site which is here and when you are happy you just click publish and then you can click the arrow and you can view the published site I, th this is it for this tutorial is really basic tutorial but uh, i hope it helped you out out if it did please leave a like subscribe to the channel and i will see you in the next video